Hey G Squad, welcome back to my episode of Is It Worth It? So in this episode, we have this cool amazement product right here in my hand and basically what these are is some shower curtains. So both of these are the same thing, but the only difference is the color design for both of these. So if I turn it around, you can see that this is basically what it looks like. So one of them is like a gray color and one of them is a white one right here. And see the bottom part right there, the ring for the top part of the shower curtain is different as well. So there's a black one here. And right here is the white one. So before I actually open the product up and show you guys how to set it up, I do want to talk about some of the specs that's on here first. So the overall design and the material that they use for this uh, shower curtain itself is pretty high quality. If you're really curious about what they use on here, you have to infer to this image right here. On the bottom of the product itself, and see the image itself, it mentioned how it has a weighted option to actually hold down the curtain itself. So that way when you're showering, it won't fly off, it won't go too high or whatever. So the next thing that I actually mentioned about the product itself is the fact that they provide you guys the hook. So that way you can actually hook it onto your shower rod. The next thing that I actually mentioned about the product itself is the fact that it's waterproof or water resistant. So if you guys do get water on it, it should come down real easily and should be easy to clean. But we'll definitely test that out in a second. Next thing that I actually mentioned about the product itself is the fact that the fabric on there is pretty high quality. So obviously when you guys feel the material on here, it should feel really, really nice. Like I mentioned earlier, it is waterproof and the actual material on here should be quick drying as well. So if you guys do get water onto it, it should dry a lot faster than a lot of other curtains out there today. Probably one of the coolest things that I actually mentioned about the product itself is the fact that it's supposed to be anti-mildew. So that's actually really important. So that way you don't have to worry about any mildew getting onto your curtains over time when you guys use it more and more. And obviously for the product itself, it is machine washable. So you definitely throw it into the machine to wash it. And for this shower curtain, it mentions how it should fit almost for any type of like bathroom, bathtubs or whatever. But that is basically everything that's on the product itself. Let me actually open up each one of these to show you guys what it actually looks like before we actually set it up. So I'll start with the white one right here first. So here are the 12 shower rings right here that you guys can actually use to uh, install the curtain itself. And then right here, we have the actual fabric for the actual shower curtain itself. Let's take it out. But right here, we have the actual shower curtain itself. Let's open up. All right, so when you open up, they do provide guys this little board to hold up the shower curtain itself. But when we open it up, you guys can see it's quite big, almost as big as like the curtain that is used for windows. So this is the bottom part right here. Let me flip it around. All right, so this is the top part right here. And the way how you guys know is by looking at the top part right here where they have the shower rings right here. And the material that they use on here, I believe is stainless steel as well. So that we can hold it a lot better over time. And these are pretty unique as well because if you guys look at the hold right here, the ring right here, it's much smaller than a lot of other shower curtains I've tested in the past. But this is basically what the back part looks like right here. Let me flip it around the other side. All right, so this is basically what it looks like in the front side right here. So definitely pretty big. I can't even fit the whole entire thing in the actual video itself right here. But definitely show you guys what it actually looks like once you guys fully install it. Let me actually open up the other one to show you guys what that one looks like as well. So for this one, they provide you guys the black rings right here, the shower rings. They also provide you guys this part right here. And when you guys open it up, they also provide you guys the board in here. And when you guys fully open it, you guys can see that this is basically what it looks like in the front part right here. And when you turn it around, this is what it looks like on the other side right here. And we just look at the bottom part right here and feel it. They definitely have that kind of like lead material, the lead thing on the bottom part to hold down the curtain itself. So that way when you're showering, it won't fly off. It won't keep going like this. It just stays still like down there, which is pretty cool. And this one also has the stainless steel shower range right here or this part right here. So that way you can actually put the shower ring inside right here to hold it up onto the shower curtain itself. When we feel the material for both the shower curtain, it definitely feels pretty nice. I can definitely feel that waterproof material like instantly right here. So I definitely feel pretty confident of using this product itself when we actually use water on here. It should be fully waterproof. But that's basically what both of them look like. Let me actually go install both of them and show you guys what both of them look like. And then we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so once you guys fully assemble the product itself, this is basically what it should look like for this color right here. So when you guys install these rings right here pretty easily, you just need to open up like this. And you just have to slide it in right here like this really easily. And just go like that. And that's how you guys hook in all 12 of these. If you can see, this is basically what it looks like once you guys fully assemble it. Let me actually install the other one as well and show you guys what that one looks like before we do the waterproof test. All right, so once you guys fully assemble this one right here, this is basically what it looks like. So I actually like the color of this one a lot. It blends really well with the black uh, rings that we have right here. All right, so this is basically what it looks like for this one. If I slide it over. So this is basically what it looks like when you guys put it side by side right here. And on the bottom right here for both of them, if you guys feel the material on the bottom right here, they do have that lead material that they mentioned so that we can actually hold down the actual curtain itself. So the both of these are the same exact curtain, they're just different color. Let me actually just test out one of them to show you guys whether or not it's actually waterproof or not. All right, so we got the product right here. Let's turn on the water and test it out. All right, 
and see the water comes off really easily. Like this part right here, I put a lot of water. You can see it's a bit darker, so the water got soaked in right here. But it still came off pretty easily. So I definitely see the test itself that it is waterproof, which is pretty awesome. All right, so this is basically what the product looks like once you guys finish using it. You can definitely see that dark spot right here it's because a lot of water got in right there. But the product itself is pretty waterproof and you see all the water dropped down and fell off really easily. All right, welcome back guys. So now you guys saw the quick test of the product itself and then definitely see that both of them look amazing and works pretty well. So obviously for the test itself, I only did a waterproof test for one of them since both of them are the same thing. But you definitely see from the curtain itself, it is pretty waterproof. Like once I put water on there, it just slides down really easily. And the product itself, it definitely dries pretty fast as well, just like I mentioned, which is pretty cool. So that way you guys don't have to worry about it taking a really long time for the shower curtain itself to dry up. So it's super important for you guys to use your shower head to like rinse off the actual shower curtain itself to remove any kind of like soap from the actual shower curtain itself. Because doing that will actually help prolong the life of your uh, shower curtain. So that way it doesn't build any like mildews or stains or whatever over time. But now that we do the unboxing and testing the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I definitely have to say that these shower curtains in particular are super worth it if you guys want more than need one of these. Especially if you guys are in the market looking for brand new shower curtains that are waterproof, water resistant, and has that very plain look to it that doesn't have too much logo or design onto it, then these are super worth it. <laughs> But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have need one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.